What is it, everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to boil water and cook food in seven days to die. Uh, I believe this, I'm not sure what it is, maybe Alpha 14, but it's the newest one that's out right now on consoles for Xbox One and PS4. So what you want to do is that you want to take what you need, say if it's uh, some meat or whatever, you know. Uh, so you take your meat or your water, what you want to do is you place that in your inventory. It took me a while to figure this out. Uh, it didn't really much make much sense. Uh, you can burn wood at the fire, campfire you make. Uh, so you need a cooking pot, I believe, for water to boil that. Um, so what you want to do, so uh, for so for instance, you want to make purified water. You click on it, or not click on it, yeah, you hit triangle. And then, hit after you hit triangle, hold on a second, still learning the controls. You go to recipes. Hit left, but go to recipes, and you click on the boil water. And then, here's the thing about it, is that you ha it has to say half one. So if you had it like I did before, I put it in here, I didn't know what was going on. Because I thought you put it in here, you know, the output. You put it in here to, you know, um, you put it in here to try to cook it, whatever. Same thing with the meat. For example, let me go on meat. Okay, now let me hit that. So if you go to recipes, charred meat, it says zero as well. Same thing as it says this. So, but what you have to do, you have to actually have it, um, you actually have to have it in your inventory or on you, you know, in your, uh, your uh, live inventory. So what you want to do is that you click on it, hit recipes, go to whatever you want to make it out of and hit cook took me a while to figure it out I just pretty much just like figured it out uh, it's really you can, you can cook multiple things as well um, so again go to recipes uh, you know charred meat so you now cook one of those um, output pretty much is the storage that's the amount of items you can put in your fireplace, out of your fireplace. It, you, uh, the amount of items you can put in your um, your uh, your campfire. So, and then you have the water. So, pretty much the output shows you. It'll pop up here after you make that, you know, food or whatever, or water. So that's how you make it. And then, as always, for food, you have to store that back. Um, in the uh, storage like that and that's how you make uh, water so uh, until next time I'll see you guys all on the next one for more I may do more of these how to and stuff because uh, at first I know I was confused so um, but now hopefully that helps you clear up your mind a little bit but until next time see you later